Suck Everlasting is this beautiful story about a little girl who runs away from home and meets this family in the woods who just drank um, from a magical spring and can, is now blessed or cursed with everlasting life. Um, and through this little girl and this family, we get to talk about death and more importantly, how we live a fulfilling and meaningful life with our family and friends. The purpose of the show is to understand how, I mean, life works in general, but to understand and how to cherish what you have and what will pass. And that's kind of a very cool, I think, message because, I mean, it really makes you want to hold your loved ones close to you and it makes you want to cherish what you have. I just think it's a beautiful production and I, I love all of the dancing and the music is beautiful. There really is a difference in the audience when you can hear a live orchestra. I mean, there's a different kind of sound and I think that uh, with this show, it's so, it's got that folk feel and I feel like that excitement you get when you go here, if, if, you, if folk music is your thing and you go to hear a folk band at a, a bar or, or at a venue, um, there's a, an excitement that is generated inside the group. Why do we do it live? Because we don't know what could happen and that live experience touches us. CTM has such a deep history of multiple generations in casts um, and this show is no exception, if not more so. Um, people from my past um, that I've looked up to my whole life are here um, again and it's just the most heartwarming uh, aspect of CTM. Since it just got off Broadway, and this is the first time it's being done, it's not a very known show. It's sort of like surreal to be in the regional premiere. The audience who's seeing it is going to see it for the first time. Whether they've read the book or seen the movie, this is the first time that they're going to see this show. Just the sheer uh, magnitude of the Broadway production. Um, in the Playhouse, we get such a wonderful experience to take all of that and just shrink it down. And I think it just tells the story so much better. You know, life has a lot of challenges and it has a lot of hard times and it has a lot of sad times, but without those you don't appreciate the good times and the successes and the rewards and you've got to have both. It's very enjoyable for everyone to watch and there's just a very a, a serene, almost calm feeling that you get after the show of just understanding like, wow, that, that just happened, oh my gosh.